Hello and welcome to a Nicomedia mini tutorial. Uh, I got many questions how to make your own layout. So, because in my last tutorial for the update of the Nicomedia scene rig, I used this layout just for testing uh, HDRIs. So I have my HDRIs in here and can test it. So go back here. So so if I put in my scene rig here, go to my HDRI test, and so I have here my slot for the files, and here I can just drag in different files I want and test it here. Okay, and now I want to show you how you can easily do your own things here. Let's close this file. So first. What do I need? I need this uh, object manager. I need this window. I need a viewport and I need a content browser. So I don't need this. Close it. Close this. Close this and close this. And now I need just my content browser for here now. So uh, with Shift F8 you can open your content browser. And now I go to my library. This is my HDRI collection library here. Here I have all my things. You can make your own folder. So uh, if you go to presets, file, and new preset library and name it however you want. I name it for you now uh, my, my HDRIs. So the HDRI. Okay. And now in this, in my HDRI, I can add new folders, let's say studio, and make another one, indoor, okay, and you can track now, you can go to, if you want to the uh, pro, to the rig here, and take some studios from here to your HDI, which this one you, you use most. Uh, so let's say I want this and just drag it in here. Take this and just drag it in here. So now I have this two uh, HRIs also here in my folder, in my own folder. And you can do the same uh, from other, uh, from each uh, folder on your hard drive. So let's say you go to indoor and you have somewhere, uh, I don't know where I have, yeah, what I have seen is it does not work if you have it on a on a uh, an, an NAS or on a, on a network drive. Then it doesn't work to uh, just drag it in. I don't know why, but it doesn't work. But so to do it on your hard drive in your on your PC or Mac. So and I have here one on my desktop, one HDRI. And I just drag it now, from, and this is on another monitor, but I just drag it now, here it is. I just drag it in my folder in here. And I have my HDRI here in my folder now. It's, it's an auto HDRI, okay, and I call it into, but doesn't matter, we know what it is. Uh, just rename this, let's see, outdoor. So, refresh here, and of course it's wrong spelled. Outdoor. So if you refresh. Okay. So I want this one. So I take this one. And what I don't need for my uh, preview, I don't need the tree, the tree view here. I need just this one here. Now I go to this pointed edge here, and click on it and drag it to the uh, to the position I want it. I don't want it here on the side. You see, it gets highlighted where, where you can put it. So this is the right position I want it. So I leave the mouse button and I have it here where I want it. So, okay. The next thing I want is uh, here the project manager. No, not the project manager, I want it. I'll show you what I mean. I want to uh, go to my rig here. I put in my rig. Here, I want this window next to the viewport. So I go to this pointed edge here and you see it get highlighted in the middle here. And check. 
that's what I want. And I don't need the layer manager, so close it. And this I need just so that I can read it to this object manager. That's enough. And let's see this like this. So, and now I easily can drag everything I want in this slot, and so I can test my my scene here. So if I want to test it now, let's see how everything should work fine here. So make so I have now this here, and if I want. I go up one level, go to the studios, drag the studio in, and I see, okay, now I have this light. And so you can easily uh, test your HDRIs, and if you are satisfied with your lighting, go back to the normal, uh, to the normal uh, layout. But before we do this, we want to save our layout, of course, here. So, what I do is I go to my window, customization, and save layout as. And here I just, let's say, test HDRI. Okay, save it. Uh -huh. Of course it's, so, now it's okay. And now we have it here, you see it. So now I go back to my normal layout, tutorials. And if I want to test my HDRI, so I go to test HDRI and have this layout here. So, yeah, it's so easy it is to make your own layouts. And uh, the layout, I have uh, put it my layout here in the description of this video. So you can download it. And if you download it, just go to your pro uh, to preferences here and go to the preferences folder. And all the, uh, the layouts will come under library. And here we have layout, and here are your layouts then. Okay, and so if you want to have my layout I use, this is the tutorial HDRI, you can just uh, download this the archive file I uh, uploaded it, and these two files in the archive, just drag it in here and that's it. And then you will have it here in the layout list. Okay, that's it for this. And this is the mini tutorial, I hope it helped and uh, yeah. Of course, um, with my with my uh, HDRI, the thing I give you to download, you don't have uh, all my you don't have my my HDRIs and this is something else in of course. So you don't have then uh, these indoor files and outdoor files and you have when you bought the the, the cinema for the rig the Nicomedia's rig. Uh, you get this. Uh, you get twenty of this studio HDRIs, or more than twenty, I think. But not these ones. These ones are mostly bought or, or free ones are found in the, in the internet or something else. Or you can take some HDRIs from the Sibyl uh, loader, from the SIBL loader, and, and put it in your indoor or outdoor folder or something else. Uh, with my layout, it. Uh, Download if you download my layout, it's it's just the layout, nothing more. So, but what you can do then when you take my layout, just uh, let's say, yeah. If you download my layout, you will get this. I will say so. Okay, do that. You will get this layout here. But you won't see this folder because because this folder will not be in your uh, content browser, of course. So you just go to view tree list, or tree view, take your, uh, let's say, my HDRI, then I don't need the tree anymore, and now just save again the layout. So save layout as, I don't want to overwrite my layout, of course, save layout as, you have here the test HDRI now, yes, and now when I go back and forth, so this is the normal layout, and the test HDRI is with this layout. Okay, I hope that helps. And uh, yeah, there will come now. I make two tutorials or one tutorial with two things. So, uh, they will come today. There will come new tutorial just for two funny spheres how I made them. And yeah, that's it for this. So bye bye and tschüss und baba.